Is this thing on? <laughs> I haven't picked up the camera since my birthday. That's a long ass time. I'm so happy to be here. Oh. oh my god. I don't even know where to begin. Do I want this to be a montage? Do I want to talk? What do I want to do? <laughs> I don't think you'll understand. Like, I feel like this is an out-of-body experience. Like, I don't even know <laughs> what to do with myself right now. Like, I don't know. This video is going to be... It's just, this is just a welcome back video, okay? I don't know if I'm going to be fine with the edits on this one. I don't know if there's going to be montages, but... <sighs> Girl... Girl, I don't even, I feel discombobulated. Like, how do I do this? How do I film anymore? Like, <laughs> let's montage it. to catch you guys up on. Life has been lifing. Sometimes when we stay in like newer hotels, and this is how I know it's a, this is must be a new contract because they don't got no microwave. And y'all know how I am, ain't much change, okay? But it's such a nice hotel. Like it's just, it's so, it's like almost like a boutique hotel. It's a standard, um it's one of your standard brands of a hotel and typically they are always the same um but this hotel is a little different i don't know what's going on with my stand and why it's like low-key leaning to the side like that but forgive me it's like crooked and shit anyways i know that this is a new contract it has to be because they don't got no damn um Two reasons. One, they don't have no microwave. And so I know not enough people have been here to complain about it. Um, because being a hotel that um, flight attendants stay at, you need a microwave. We literally pack food for multiple days. Like, you need a microwave. Like, like I'm sorry. It's just there's no, there's nothing else to say other than you need a mother freaking microwave. Okay. Um, second that you most times when um we stay at hotels the contract is used to us being here and typically we, our rooms do not get serviced um so for them to like knock on the door just now it's kind of a little bit tab i don't know if taboo is the word but like that typically doesn't happen when with flight attendant rooms usually any rooms that our flight attendant rooms are completely blocked off and they don't like knock on our doors or anything um while we're during during the duration of our stay um it happens here and there but i like you could just tell like well, this is definitely a new contract because we did used to stay somewhere else in the in um i'm in sacramento right now we did used to stay somewhere else for our sacramento layover and now we're at a new hotel and i'm not gonna lie i like this hotel it's super super cute um but yeah i don't know Okay, so let's make some coffee, y'all. It's still the morning. Well, technically, it's about to be noon, but you know me. I'm doing all my morning things. I'm about to journal. I'm about to do all the things. So let's make us some coffee. But this cup is so small, I might need two. Well, actually, if I go and have breakfast, they serve breakfast here till about 2 o'clock every day, which is so good for me because i'm a breakfast girl and i need breakfast <laughs> every day no matter what time i wake up i don't care what time it is um 
Okay, let's see. Chamomile tea, breakfast, English breakfast tea, decaf, decaf. Okay, regular classic. Oh, wait, how do I? Oh, that's interesting. We're going to let that do its thing. Um, I have this cute little seating area over y'all this hotel is so sticky cute like look at this little area right here so this is where i'm going to sit to do my journaling and stuff my routine is still the same every single morning um i might film a new updated like morning routine video for you guys um i moved <laughs> there's just so much going on y'all so i haven't yet i so may was just all over the place it didn't really work all that much because i was moving so now we're back in the swing of things i need to be at work girl we are almost done with this journal time really flies like this is all i have left i'm gonna be done with this literally in like probably another week <laughs> so i should really go shopping for a new journal which is exciting i love journal shopping and now it's 1206 so i'm gonna stop chatting i'm gonna have my coffee i'm gonna journal do my devotional and then we're gonna get dressed and, and head downstairs and see what their breakfast menu is looking like if the menu is mid i'm going to we can see what's in the area or just like maybe order some food thank god i was this close to cooking for work and bringing food thank god i didn't do that because they don't have a freaking microwave like that would have pissed me off so bad um had i brought like my food oh my coffee's ready hold on we're journaled we're meditated we're devoted now we're gonna go to the gym um i looked at the menu for the restaurant downstairs for breakfast and it just in my opinion and it was just so unreasonable like if i'm honest i just didn't feel like paying 30 dollars for no breakfast so i still haven't eaten we're about to go work out first and then i found a couple of like healthier food options like in the vicinity of where my hotel is so we're gonna go explore some of those anyways Let's go to the gym. Okay, made it to the gym. It's not bad. They got a little vending machine right here if you need some water. All right, all right. I can work with this. Today I'm doing upper body. Um, Hi, that's me. I'm going to do upper body today, so I know for a fact I'll be using this machine. I'll be needing some dumbbells, and I'll need a bench. So I'm just going to go ahead and set myself up over here. Luckily, I am alone in the hallways as always. No, I'm alone in the gym, so we love that. Hopefully, I can be alone for the duration of my workout. That would be really nice. So, anyways, let's get to it. So, when I am not at Hotworks, I use the Ladder app, and I absolutely love the Ladder app. It is basically, it gives you exactly what your workouts are. It connects to your Apple Music. Um, it's timed. It keeps the progression of your workout we right now we're warming up so i'm supposed to be doing cat cow right now it gives you a cool little timer this app is just a one i love it I'm gagged. I just found the dopest vintage thrift shop in Sacramento. I think I'm like downtown Sacramento. Y'all, they got the shoes, the pants, all the vintage, gosh darn, hoodies and sweaters and all the things. Like, I mean, you freaking name it. They got everything in here. This is really like 
cool as hell. Like I'm, I really want to pick this layover back up again and come with my coin ready because it's so much stuff in here. They got a good amount of stuff. It's mostly like men's clothing though. But you know, to a real thrift girly, that doesn't mean anything for real. So it's really the hoodies and the jackets for me. Like if I came back, that is, and I broke another nail by the way. If I came back, that's exactly what I would come in here and I would shop for, is all these vintage jackets. The freaking brown corduroy Levi, goddamn. I mean, this is, this, I'm, um, yeah, they gonna have to see me again. They gonna have to clean in Hollywood, freaking, like, come on. Yeah, tough, 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 tough. My God. I found somewhere to eat. It's called a Koja Kitchen. Um, I probably should have got something a little healthier, but it's fine. The menu is up there. I, it's like a Korean barbecue spot, I think. <laughs> I don't really know, but I ended up getting a barbecue chicken sandwich. Ended up getting a barbecue chicken sandwich. Um, so, I just know that at this point in my life right now, in this very moment, I am starving, so. And it was nice to come outside to get some, like, sun on my skin. The area, this downtown Sacramento area, is way better than where we used to stay. I actually like it down here. There's all kind of food options. Um, and I actually think this place turns into, like, a little bit of, like, a lounge or a nightclub at night. So, had I known, I would have laid over here last night but the food it smells good in here um so hopefully the food it tastes good i'll probably go back to my room after this because there's really nothing else to really be doing for real um but it's warm today it's a warm day in sacramento the sun's out it's a good it's good weather today i brought my book so i can sit and read while i eat um yeah, that's the vibes. I love doing solo shit on my layovers. Like, it's nice. Yes, the food is here. Take a look. Oh my god, yeah. Yeah, I'm excited. This is crazy post workout, but you know what? It is what it is. Like usual, we're gonna take a bite on camera. I'm not mad at this at all. 